There's a couple ways we can think about this problem. I think perhaps the most intuitive is to get the x squared by itself. And I can do that by adding 16 on both sides. And of course is going to give me x squared equals 16. And if I take the square root of both sides, then I get that x is equal to plus or minus 4. We need to make sure we include that negative 4 because negative 4 ne times negative 4 is equal to 16 just as much as positive 4. Alternative ways to think about this is a difference of squares. We know uh, that if we have something squared minus something else squared, it can be factored as first thing plus second thing times first thing minus second thing. So in this case, this is just x squared minus 4 squared. So we know that that can be written as x plus 4 times x minus 4. And all of that is equal to 0. So in order for that to be true, either this has to be 0 or this has to be 0. The first binomial is 0 if x is negative 4. The second if x is positive 4. So we see that we do get the same result, that x is equal to positive or negative 4. Thank you.